it's a quite a big misconception that knowledge and skills are completely and utterly separate. In actual fact, they're just always interwoven. And there are these ideas that skills are just the fluency of knowledge that you already have. Thinking about the fact that they need to be interwoven because there was curriculum design before this where they tried to break knowledge and skills up and they were separate and they had skills ladders at which you me measured students on. That doesn't work because you can't really have one without the other, either way around you think about it. There are discrete skills that obviously we want to teach our students. So things like resilience, teamwork, flexibility, adapt, all of those kind of things are almost discrete skills that we want built into our curriculum so that students are problem solving so that they don't give up and all of those kind of things. But actually you do then have more explicit skills that you're trying to teach students and a big one that I'm quite passionate about and we're quite passionate about in my school is this idea of how to deal with money. Yes, I can teach you what a budget is, but you know what? Here's the budgeting spreadsheet that I actually use personally. Let's go through it. And if you decide to go to university, what does that look like? Actually put in the rent. Or those people that want to go on and do an apprenticeship, absolutely brilliant. Do you know how much tax that's going to be? Do you know what that actually looks like? How much money you have in your pocket? Do you genuinely know how much it would be to rent an apartment with your friends? Do you genuinely know how much that is and how much of an effect that will have? Again, it's a skill, but it's also the knowledge that we're teaching those students and that rich curriculum and that powerful knowledge that our students need to have in order to be able to thrive. That again, wasn't really something that you were necessarily taught explicitly when you were at school before. You kind of just somehow managed to pick it up. Or you might have had a family member that might have been able to help you, but we can't necessarily rely on that.